Hey guys, on today's video, I'm going to teach you how to download Fortnite for Mac. So, right here in epicgames.com, you guys can go to this by Safari or Google Chrome, doesn't really matter. And up here, you guys will see search Epic Game Store. So just type in Fortnite, and you guys will see this popping up. All right, so just click on free, then click on free again, and it's going to ask you this. So right now you guys need to sign in. If you guys don't have an account right now, you guys can always sign up. So that's down here below. It tells you to sign up if you guys don't have a sign in just yet. Or else you guys can sign in with your Facebook, Xbox, depending what credentials you guys have. You guys can use them right now in order to sign in. Once you guys sign in, you guys should see your name up here. So right here it says tech and design. That's my account. And right here in the middle, you guys will see the install button. Just click on it and right here again, download Epic Games Launcher. So let's just click right there in the middle. It's going to download the launcher right now. So right here on the left hand side, I can see that the DMG file. So once that's done downloading, I can actually install this. So right now I can see that it downloaded. So I'm going to click here on the bottom left hand side. It's going to expand this out. I'm going to show in Finder. I could have just put open by the way. However, I like to see my files. So right here it's DMG. So I'm going to double click on this. And make sure you guys go to this website to download this because there's a lot of fake websites out there and viruses going around. So don't get fooled by that. Go into Epic Games to do this, all right? So right here, all we have to do is drag this and put it here in applications. So right now that it's in applications, under our finder, we can also go into applications. So right here under finder, just go into applications. So let's just click there. And we're going to see under applications right here, Epic Games Launcher. All right. So let's just double click on that to launch it up. Let's close this window, by the way. You guys will see this. Now, if for some reason, it doesn't let you open this thing because it's not official from Mac. Don't worry about it. There's ways to get around that problem. So let's just click on open for now. So before I continue on right now, it's downloading it. I'm going to quickly teach you if you guys have any problems opening this up. So you guys will have to go into system preferences under system preferences. You guys will see security and privacy under security and privacy right down here below. You guys can click on the second option. So just make sure to click on this lock to unlock this and then change it up to the second option. Once you guys do that, just close this up. All right, now that you downloaded this thing, we have to sign in again. I know, I know. But again, you guys can pick whatever you guys want. I'm gonna do it through Xbox. You guys will see this, just click on agree, accept. And right here, this is important. So you guys should know where this is going. So again, you guys can change this up or you guys can leave it as is. So I'm going to just install. Just remember where it's installing so you guys know for the future. Okay, you guys might get this window. Don't worry about it. You guys can close it for now. We're not really talking about that at the moment. So if you guys click right here on downloads, so it should be right here on the bottom. Just click on downloads. So you guys can see the progress and what is actually happening. Because I know it can get kind of confusing of what's actually happening with this thing. However, right now I can see Fortnite's installing. It is a couple gigs, so it really depends on your internet speed at this point. It can take hours or it can take minutes. Again, it all depends on your max speed plus your internet speed, mostly internet speed. Just make sure you guys have a couple gigs left over on your Mac. I always suggest having at least 50 gigs of free space. And to download this thing, I would have at least 100 gigs of free space for your Mac to run smoothly and for you guys to be able to enjoy this game. If you guys don't have that much space, then it's going to lag and you guys don't want that. Once the game has downloaded, so right here, you guys will see nothing because it's done and done. All right. So what we have to do is just go into home, for example, or store for that matter. And we're going to look for Fortnite. So again, I just look for Fortnite up here. This came up, I'm gonna click on it, and I have it. So this is one of the ways to launch it, by the way. And right here, we're gonna see launch. So we're gonna do that.
and we're gonna get right into the game. So right now it's loading and we get to play right away. So there might be a few things that it has to refresh and download a little bit, but that's it. Right now you guys can play, it's gonna play really fast, it all depends on your computer speed and your internet speed obviously. And that's it for this video tutorial, if you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you. Oh, 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 oh,